Did you know that a single screwdriver slip almost triggered a nuclear explosion in a lab? In August 1945, Louis Slotin stood in a dim Los Alamos laboratory, demonstrating what scientists called routine work. He was using a plutonium sphere nicknamed the Demon Core. Around him, fellow physicists watched as he placed two beryllium hemispheres around the deadly core. One rested below, the other hovered just above, separated by a gap no thicker than a thumbnail. To maintain that gap, he used nothing but a flathead screwdriver. Everyone knew what would happen if the hemispheres touched. The core would go supercritical, unleashing lethal radiation. Then his hand slipped. The screwdriver slid off. The beryllium halves clicked together. Instantly, the room erupted in blinding blue light. Cherenkov radiation flooded the air like atomic fire. Slotin felt the invisible storm burn every cell in his body. He quickly separated the hemispheres, but it was too late. Nine days later, his skin peeled away in sheets. His organs failed one by one. The demon core had claimed another victim, 